Hello my friends, I hope you're having a lovely day, and in today's video, we are going to be playing some Super Mario Brothers on Super Mario All-Stars, because it was Super Mario Brothers' 35th anniversary. I know uh, Nintendo's celebrating that, but uh, yesterday was actually the day uh, that Super Mario Brothers released 35 years ago. We are playing the... Uh, Super Mario All-Stars version, sorry. There's so many Mario names lately. Uh, we're playing Super Mario All-Stars version of Super Mario Brothers, just because uh, Nintendo released this in honor of uh, the 35th anniversary of Mario, as they're doing with a whole bunch of other things for Mario. So I figured that this is the version I'd go with. I'm going to try and see if I can make it to the end. <laughs> Now, obviously, uh, I I grew up with this game. This is my uh, my era. This is when I was a baby boy. I would play this. I will never forget the day when I saw the original, and I was just blown away by it. My cousin had an NES. I didn't even know what an NES was, and I just uh, it, I was like, "What? Is, oh, like I knew what video games were. Obviously, I played stuff in the arcade, but." Just, and I had played an Atari before, but just seeing this at home and it was, you know, brand new. I didn't know who Mario was or anything. And I was just like, God, I've never seen anything greater. It, do it doesn't get any better than this. And uh, that started my lifelong passion for, uh, obviously, Nintendo, but video games in general. And uh, it is directly responsible for what I do for a living. Run, go Nintendo, and do videos like this, the podcasts, all that stuff. It it's... Uh, it's crazy to think how, uh, like I said, I played arcade games and all that when I was a kid. My parents took me into arcades and we played stuff, but this game right here is responsible for a very large portion of my life. It sent me down the path uh, for uh, people I would meet and work with and my job in general. And, you know, I, I had no clue that any of that was going to happen. I was just... Playing games as a fan, playing Super Mario Brothers as a fan of Mario, and here I am. So, uh, screwed up already. Um, yeah, I, I obviously I played this a lot when I was a kid. I beat the game. I've run all the way through the regular way. Uh, I've done the warps. We're going for the warps here for time. And uh, no matter how many times I play this game, there's something about it. That keeps me feeling nervous. Something about the jumps. So, like this level coming up has a jump right in the beginning. That makes me extremely nervous. And recording makes me nervous as well, no matter how many times I do it. That jump right there still <laughs> makes me nervous. Um, but I made it. And then the last, like, the, just the whole end of the game in general makes me nervous. Alright. Now it has been a while. All right, it's here, right? Yes. Well, I'll do it. Don't. Want, I used to screw this up as a kid all the time. I'd hit like a block too far and not be able to do it. See that? He doesn't even need the vine to climb. <laughs> Climbed off the top of the screen without it. I don't think it works in this one. Oh, it still does. <laughs> I used to think that was the funniest thing as a kid. I was like, look at that. Uh, but this game brings back such memories. Playing uh, with my cousin, like I said, playing just in general with friends, playing with my uh, mom, who still plays video games, as many of you know. Um, there's just something, there, there's, and it's not, an, an, it's not a nostalgia thing. There's just something timeless about this game. It's like, you know, it was uh, such an important game to the game industry, uh, the game industry that was, you know, coming back from the, uh, I don't want to say the failure, but, you know, the the situation with Atari, like, the the video game industry was, was in shambles, if you could even say that there really was one. People didn't know if things were going to continue. Um, there were certainly companies that were trying, but uh, thanks to games like Super Mario Brothers and the NES in general, oh, God, things continued on. So, hugely influential, important game, and, uh, oh, God, <laughs> uh, most, there's another jump up here that, yep, yeah, makes me nervous. Here we go. Oh, God. 
<laughs> gets, I, no matter how many times I do it, still nervous. Ah, uh, this too. I always, like, I get so twitchy. Oh my god. I'm gonna fly out of my chair. Why is it, like, there's so many other platformers that I've played. And so many other games uh, where you have holes and gaps like that. But for some reason, this one... Like, this beginning here makes me nervous. Why is that? I don't get it. It's a good thing, though. Keeps you on... Uh, keeps you on your toes. I say it's a good thing, and then I get nervous as I'm playing. Oh, man. I didn't... You know what? Uh, it's a whole new added layer of pressure playing in recording. All right, calm down there. Jesus. Um, oh, 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 boy. Oh, boy. I hate it. I hate it. There's, now, this is the kind of situation where you're like, I'm going to jump now, and then the thing shoots. I got lucky. Um, yeah, there's a whole added pressure to playing and, and recording. Um, you know, it doesn't matter. Oh, how did I used to do... Okay, I think I used to do this. Yeah. Um, yeah, recording, it just makes me, it always makes me nervous. Uh, if it's a, a game I've never oh, he, he played, it's not a big deal. Uh, but if it's a game like this where, come on, it's Super Mario Brothers, everybody's played this. <laughs> I hate it. Um, so the, ex the pressure's on. It's like, this game's 35 years old and you can't figure out how to play it yet? Oh god, my hands are sweating. My goal was, get to 8-3... With the fire flower. <laughs> and lose it right away. Um, because the Hammer Brothers in this level are such a pain in the ass. I hate the Hammer Brothers in general, but this level... I wanted the hammers, so I didn't have to worry about it. Okay. Take it nice and easy. No big deal. I... Th oh, boy. There's something at the end of this level, too. Oh, it's two more rough jumps that scare me. Alright. There we go. Nothing to worry about. Everything's great. Man, I can't believe I remember where, like... These, uh... All these blocks are. I mean, I guess it makes sense, because I've played this a bazillion times, but still. You know, the first level you remember, but the other ones... Okay, things are going good. Is this the end already? Sure, I'll grab some coins. We're not going for a speed record here. Oh, God. I am so nervous right now. Just go. Oh. <laughs> Man. Goes to show just how well designed the game is because it still feels like it's the first time you're playing it. Go back to it every few years and see if you still got it. Now, I don't remember the way through the castle, to tell you the truth. I think I remember. We are going to find out together. I'm going to guess I'll make a wrong turn. Uh, but yeah, it's good to practice this now because uh, Super Mario Bros. 35 is coming. And you need to be good at the original Super Mario Brothers to play that. Uh, I believe I take this one. And that's putting you, uh, in the original Super Mario Bros., but against real people, so you gotta, you gotta know what's going on. I can't wait to play that. I'm so excited for that. Alright, I know I take this. Uh, yeah, I'm really excited for that game. I just want to see how it really plays out. Like, the Tetris, it's easy enough to be like, yeah, you know... Tetris have, has had competitive multiplayer for a while. Well, uh, god damn it, it's all over. This one? Oh no, it is all over, because there's that hammer brother. Oh god, I blew it. I blew it. No, you. Oh god, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. I really wanted to make it through this without dying. The dream is over. Oh boy. I don't remember where anything is in this level, like a mushroom or anything. I got I got nothing. Well, 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 I'm screwed. <laughs> oh god, I can't even go down the pipe. 
whatever. Super Mario Bros. 35. Yeah, Tetris multiplayer. You're like, yeah, I get how that works. I understand how that uh, functions with other people competitively. How you get impacted and by uh, others' moves. But, it, you know, even though we've seen a trailer for Super Mario Bros. 35, I'm still very curious to see how it all works out. And clearly I need to practice more because I screwed this up. Is it this one? I'm not even paying attention. Okay. Oh, man. I gotta do this small... Can't even be Super Mario. I gotta be Mario. Can you go the other way, dude? Come over here. This way. This way. Okay. Nice and easy. Then I come out here. Then there's gonna be a Hammer Brother, and I'm screwed. I almost dropped an F-bomb. <laughs> I know I curse, uh, you know, a little bit in these, but not not the F-bomb, but I almost did. I hate you, dude. I hate you so much. I never know when to go. Oh, there it was. Should have went. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> no! Oh my god. I should not be alive. I want to... I want to die. Oh god. Oh my god, after that amazing situation with the Hammer Brother. Oh, damn it. Oh my god, my heart is panning. I, this is exactly what I didn't want this video to turn into. Me just struggling to make it to the end and probably not being able to do it. <laughs> Happy Super Mario Brothers 35th anniversary, everybody. Watch me, a grown man, who writes about Nintendo every single day, played all the Mario games, yet I can't beat the first one. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> this is it. This is what happens with me and games. I fall apart. Wouldn't it be nice if, like, the last life I make it through and I win... Be such a great victory. It's not gonna happen though. I'm telling you right now, it's not gonna happen. <sighs> if I break the run that I'm trying to do, uh, and I had that death, that's it. Did I do the wrong thing? Yeah, I did. Son of a bitch. Yeah, if I break that run, it's over. I screw up and uh, I, I miss basic things like that. I didn't even, I walked past the right pipe and I didn't even realize it. Is there something in there? I don't know. It doesn't matter anymore. It doesn't matter. It don't matter. Oh, my stomach hurts. <laughs> I really want this to end a victory so bad, but I know myself too well for that. The uh, controller is slipping out of my hands. Come this way, dude. This way, this way, this way, this way, dude. Dude, dude. Uh, you know, I'm not trying to do anything to you guys. Just hang out here. You got a nice place to yourself. You can touch fire. It doesn't even matter to you. Enjoy it. Well, here we are. I'm sure someone's going to be like, Hey, there's, the there's a mushroom at this... You know... Trying to decide if I should run underneath them. Maybe I'll do that. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> yes! 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 Oh, it wasn't a failure. Oh, thank god. Oh, man. I like how it's the greatest victory in my life to beat the original Super Mario Brothers. <laughs> Well, happy 35th anniversary, Super Mario Brothers. Uh, thanks for watching and <laughs> whatever. <laughs> watching, liking, subscribing, commenting, it's very much appreciated. Also, a huge thank you to those of you who support the Patreon. Uh, helps me do videos like this where I embarrass myself. Uh, helps with uh, social media, the site, podcasts, all that good stuff. It means a lot. 
If you want to learn more about the Patreon, which is just a dollar, you can check out the link in the description below. But as for today, that is it. Thank God, because my heart can't take any more. So, I'll be back tomorrow with something. That's the new thing. I'll be back tomorrow with something no matter what. A uh, new sort of fun video. So until then, have a lovely day. Have a lovely evening. And I'll see you in a few short hours.